Hello everyone, welcome back. My name is Joren or Triplus as I like to make myself known online. And today a very, very short video on how to replace the battery on the Akara um, temperature and humidity sensor. Um, sounds stupid, sounds easy, but um, I almost ruined one uh, on the back side by, uh, by trying to remove the battery. So as you can see here, there is supposed to be like a, a little uh, slot that you can put like I would assume a screwdriver or a coin in. Um, and um, you would just be able to turn it. So I tried it on the other one and well, basically the whole backside of, uh, <clears throat> of the sensor is ruined. But um, after a lot of uh, searching around, I found a solution that's actually quite simple. So just find something plastic, I would say, uh, that you do not or that you don't care if it's, uh, if it's a bit broken or if it has sticky residue on it. Uh, remove like the, the, the sticky tape, um, like the, the double-sided tape. So remove the, the protector of it, partially. Paste it on your plastic surface, push a bit, and then you can easily just turn it around and there you go. So that's all you need to do basically to, to get this open. I was unable to get it to open any other way. Um, but this is how I got it open. So let's quickly replace the battery now. So once your battery is back installed, uh, you can verify by pushing the button if it will blink. So there we go, the battery is installed. So now um, find the correct orientation. I forgot how I put this on. Um, there we go. Twist it back and now we can pull it off and then put the protective film on it again. And there you go, your battery is replaced. So that's it, very easy once you know how to do it. I spent around 30 minutes last time trying to figure this out, uh, ruining the backside of my sensor. Um, hope this is of some help to, to those of you who are also struggling with this. Thanks a lot for watching, hope to see you again in the next one. Bye!